friends, it's Sherry here, and today in this video, okay, so do y'all know about the strawberry dress? It was like a huge thing in 2020, which kind of feels like a million years ago, but also feels like it was yesterday. It's weird, time makes no sense, and nothing makes sense but yeah the strawberry dress like literally if you type into google the strawberry dress it just comes up and i'm just like i wanted it i looked up the price it, it was way like, too expensive for me now it's not expensive expensive to the extent if like i wanted to buy it i couldn't but i would have a hard time justifying paying that much for like any item of clothing even if it is like the most beautiful dress. <laughs> now, the internet was going crazy over this dress because like, first of all, like the strawberries and the pinkness and I don't know, it just, it looked like a good time, which 2020 was a bad time. So understandably, like the internet went crazy over it. And then there was also the black version of the dress, which if I were to buy that dress, I would buy the black version because Black is more of my color, like 80% of my wardrobe is black. Which brings up to another point that like, I used to hate the color pink. Like, I'm wearing this now and you can see like my bed, but I think even three years ago, I would have a hard time wearing anything that was pink. Mostly it was just like this idea that girls had to wear pink, that was sort of like, thrusted onto me ever since childhood and it's like, like girls are pink and boys are blue and then you should be wearing pink and all the girls should be in pink to make sure we know that they're girls and I just hated it and I took that hatred out on the color pink like it's not pink so well obviously and sort of through my own growth with trying to like understand femininity and like how much I wanted to associate with femininity and that sort of weird growing up that you do, I realized that my issue wasn't with pink, but it was with like the societal standards on girls and what they had to wear to appear feminine. I'm getting very off topic, but a few days ago, I saw on Instagram that the pink strawberry dress has like, okay, so there's now a bucket hat made from the same material as the strawberry dress. It's made using like the leftover bits and pieces, I guess, which is like honestly really nice. And from what I know about the brand, everything seems to be more like either locally or like small business based. It's not like fast fashion. And so they've done things like make face hats using the material and then making bucket hats now using that material. And I saw the price, I'm just like, I could justify buying this. And so I did. And so I did, I bought this, I bought it. Okay, I'm like beyond excited. Now, I was going to get the black version with like the red strawberries, or both her red strawberries, but I decided my wardrobe kind of like needed more pink things just cause I am starting to wear more pink just cause I know my issue isn't with the color, but what's associated with the color. And so like I wear pink, I, my, favorite items of clothing are still like in black because that's the color of my soul. My soul. Well, like I'm more of a black and blue type, but I want more diversity in my clothing or else I'm always just in a black t-shirt, which is fine. But we bought it, we bought it. Okay. Okay. So it came in the mail. It roughly took two weeks. I think it took about like two weeks, but it's here. It's here. This is the brand Lyrica Matoshi. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but okay, are we ready? I haven't even opened this. I've opened the bag to see this bag, but oh my gosh. No, we can okay. Oh, it's so pink. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so pink. Okay. This, okay, this came off. This is a ribbon that came off. Just unfolding this. Da, da, it's the strawberries. It's the strawberry pink. It's the strawberry pink dress, but now it's a bucket hat. I love this. Oh my gosh. It's just so much strawberry and so much 
pink. Okay, again, I'm not like obsessed with pink, but this is like a very pretty sort of light pink color. The strawberries are just, oh my gosh. So the strawberries are just like all like little glitter bits that have been like, I guess, glued on and they're like so sparkly. Oh my gosh. I am a little apprehensive about this material as a bucket hat just cause like from my usual bucket hats are like a bit sturdier and this feels like very light, but it's like a light summer hat. Okay, are we ready? Are we ready? I'm not ready. I'm so pink. Oh my gosh. I, okay. I, I kind of do wish, this is like, I like it. It, it kind of looks like it could be a, a bonnet rather than a bucket hat just cause it's like so thin and it doesn't really hold like the bucket structure well. I think maybe like if I leave this out on top of my other bucket hats, but it is like a very cute light hat. <laughs> very so cute. Oh my gosh, I just like walk around like this, like everything I see is pink. <laughs> Generally, it fits my head surprisingly. My head's like on the slightly bigger side for women's hats, but it fits like pretty well i am surprised i knew i would like it just because like i've been like staring at the picture of that dress for so long i did not think i'd like this as much as i do right now look at all the strawberries it tastes like strawberries on a summer evening i will be definitely like wearing this out i don't know there's not like much else there's no cleaning instruction tag on this so i i wouldn't know how to clean this or do you clean hats i'm guessing you do or else it'll be like some rank hats out there but it's like it's so thin and then this could like show you how that actual strawberry dress feels if one day i can afford that strawberry dress i will buy the black one and then i'll wear this hat and then i'll wear the mask too and i'll just be a walking strawberry just be a walking strawberry. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to share this hat and also my rant in the beginning, but I just mainly wanted to share this hat with y'all. It's it's weird how clear it is. I don't have a, I don't have any clear hats, so like how I style my hair under this, I didn't think that'd be a thing. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so cute. <laughs> Why? Why am I so weird? <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I hope to see you in my next video. Please let me know what your thoughts are on this strawberry hat and the strawberry dress and everything strawberries and summer related. And if I knew how to put a poll, I'd be like black versus pink dress. But of course I don't. So just keep that to yourselves. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. I hope to see you in my next video.